Hi, this is Nikki and I am creating the flower corsage um, using the Cricut Design Space. And I decided to make this video because I just recently purchased the Cricut Explore Air. I had the expressions before, but um, it's not as advanced. So I have the Cricut Air Explorer now and I'm very, very new at um, making any projects with this. So I noticed that whenever you go to the design space and you go to make it, they give you basics on how to put things together, basically in writing. There's no visual pictures or anything like that to show you step-by-step step how to put these together. So as I was cutting these out, there's these little tab things. I don't know if you can see it, but um, they actually piece together. Now I had to watch like two other videos just to see kind of how they did it and they didn't show like an up close in focus view of how to actually put them together. So again, I was kind of at a standstill trying to figure out how to actually piece this all together. It took me about five minutes to realize how to put this together. So if you're anything like me and you're like visual, you're a visual learner, then this is definitely a video for you. So um, basically what happens is you go to the design space. It's under the Mother's uh, Day Corsage and go to where it says create it. Um, I didn't resize anything. I just hit create on all of the, the different um, cardstocks that you get. Um, make sure that you do put it on cardstock and that you don't have it on paper. Um, if you have it on paper, it will not cut all the way through the cardstock. So you'll just get kind of like an indention and um, it won't cut all the way through. So just to show you, I it started off with the light pink uh, and then it went to a darker pink and then the light green and then the dark green. So basically you get pieces like this and then you just kind of stack them on top of each other. And for this, I used a glue stick instead of the hot glue because of these small pieces. I didn't want to burn my fingers. So I just used a, a simple uh, glue stick. And let me see, there's a piece right here that's not all the way down. It's easier to lay this down on the surface and then um, put the glue on so that it sticks. But once you layer everything, it looks like that. Sorry. My grand puppy is drinking his water. And then these little pieces right here, I already stuck this on. Um, if you see these little circle, let's see, right here these little um, circle that you put together. So just put like a little dab of glue and please be careful that you don't burn yourself. And then you just put it together like that. And then you do the same thing with that side. And then again on this side. Sorry if you hear crickets in the background and everything. We have the windows open because here in California it's about 90 degrees right now in the summer. It's pretty hot. So, And then you get that. Um, you'll do the same thing with this one as well. And I kind of took this piece off because... Again, I didn't know how to put this together and I was looking for tutorials and videos, something that would show me how to actually put the darn thing together. 
why isn't my glue coming out? I'm due for an upgrade on a glue gun. And don't worry if you get like a little bit of glue. See how the glue is seeping out on that side? You can um, scrape it off if you have nails. If not, you can leave it. It's not a big deal because the flower is going to be stackable anyways. You're not even going to see that. I really wish that they would have more tutorials on how to actually put some of the um, the create it's on the design space so that you can see exactly how to put some of these together they sometimes feel that we're all professionals um, in the cricket world but um, like I said I had the expressions which was old school whenever they actually had physical cartridges you had to stick into the machine and even with that, I was very limited on uh, my design skills as far as uh, working with vinyl and uh, the cardstock and things like that. So I'm still fairly new to the Cricut game and honestly, um, a lot of the things that I've been watching have been more for people that are professional, that do this a lot and they're really savvy on how to put these things together and create it. Um, but for the people that are new to this and don't know anything about it, you know, we, we rely on videos and things like that. Sorry. So you're just gonna stack these two on top of each other. Um, so just put a small dab of glue here. And then you want to make sure that you Stagger it so that it doesn't, um, so you're not stacking the two petals on top of each other. You want to make sure that, like, you have this petal here and then this petal's over here behind it. You don't want to stack them so that it kind of staggers like that. I don't know if you can, there you go. I'm way off on my. Okay, and then with this one, it's the same thing. You're just basically going to take this little piece and put it right on top of there. <laughs> you can hear bear eating. 